so today i'm going to explain about unit 2 problems how to calculate vi vil and vih of corresponding output inverter and these are the very simple sums so in this video i'm not going to explain the calculations on that and i'll be explaining very simply and what would be the procedure and how could you do in a faster way because it takes very long time for it and um, uh, when you go on to do and first of all when you see a problem just uh, the first step is to calculate beta n and beta p and the one thing is mainly for this uh, whole problem calculating vi vl and vh you have to uh, know each and every formula perfectly so that you'd be calculating easy okay so um, i had the formulas very good uh, so first calculating beta n and beta p that's just k n dash into omega by l uh, for n mos and k by k p dash into omega by l into p mos so we have to cal calculate these two and k n dash and k p dash and omega by l and omega l for n mos p mos are given in the sum so you have to calculate beta n and beta p so again you have to calculate beta n by beta p and beta p by beta n so it will be very easy and for the formula of VIL is uh, beta n by 2 Vn a minus Vtn whole square is equals to beta p by 2 2 Vdd minus Vn minus mod of Vtp into Vd minus V out Vd minus V out whole square. So these uh, this is the one equation uh, and this is another equation Vn into 1 plus beta n by beta p is equals to 2 V out minus Vdd minus Vtp plus beta n by beta p. So these are the two equations for calculating of VIL. So first thing is um, substituting the beta n value, beta p value, VIN, VTN and VDD, VIN and these all values VDD and V out, VDD and VN and VDD we are not going to have it and so so we just keep it as like constants so variables like variables and um, let's say we substituted these all values and in the equation 1 so when we substitute the equation 1 we'll be getting an equation like say quadratic equation let's say x plus y is equal to something so this x will be v in and y will be vdd okay i will be v out v out okay i'll be v out so then uh, that's the quadratic equation of solving after this first equation e b will be a then again substitute vin plus 1 by and substitute the values i mean above values like beta n for this formula and we are showing this formula right vin into 1 plus beta n by beta p is equals to v out minus vdd minus six. this is a second formula so you have to substitute the values of beta n beta p vdd vtp and beta n beta p and vtn so that you could get the second quadratic equation so let's say x plus y something like a constant so when you get these two quadratic equations you could calculate vin and vdp so when you get these two quadratic equations my thing is you can directly calculate through calci uh, just go to the quadratic equations and just uh, write down the two equations so that that will be simple next thing here is the main thing you will get facing problem is doing a minus b whole square and multiplying it and these are the things you'll get very um, you'll be facing problems in the first equation and uh, this would take some time but if you could slow, do slowly and if you could have practice that makes you a little bit fast okay. and every in every calculating of vi and vih the first equation will be a bit large compared to the second quadratic equation so the for calculating of VIH is beta n by 2, 2 into VIN, VT out, uh, VTN into V out minus V out whole square is equal to beta P by 2, VDD minus VN, VTP. So these are the two quadratic equations again for calculating VIH. So when you substitute these values in this, so then you'll get another quadratic equation again when you substitute this value in this you will get another quadratic equation so that you could calculate vih okay you could calculate vih so vih would be uh, 1.07 
so since this sum have been uh, like uh, directly calculated it. so in this the main thing is what's vil and vih when you have this v in the this is only we calculate as vil v out is v out okay v out is v out and vih is here vin is vih you can calculate by these two quadratic equations you could solve by these two quadratic equations substituting formula can reduce and here comes the vm so vm or vi the same which say it's an average value or something average value say it is so here we wrote vm and here we write that both are same the designation is same so the formula is simple vd minus vtp plus beta n by beta p vtn by 1 plus under root beta n by beta p so this is a simple formula just substitute it and you will get directly answer so my concept is like you just go through first of all vm and then again vil and calculate uh, vih so it, it would be easy so calculating vi and uh, so when you get the vih that would be easy this is a simple thing 